Hi, I'm Esther Yeo. I had a 2020 version of Health and Safety Robot, which I'm honoured to win a Gold with Honour Award in Imagine Cup Challenge 2020 for its adoption to help in fighting COVID-19 spread in Singapore. Today, I would like to share about my improved 2021 version, which will apply to the changing needs, especially where new variants are more infectious, according to the World Health Organization. Due to possible pandemic turning into long term, robots can perform more functions 24 by 7, which can adapt according to the infection levels of the areas. Added functions. Function 1. 24 hour trace together with security camera, sensors and alarms to detect if any visitor to the area is trying to bypass it. This is to minimize humans to manage counters or areas to avoid possible infection besides saving costs and time. Function two, self disinfection function of the robot, such as having disinfection auto spray from top with warning at regular intervals, depending on the usage level. Function three, the COVID-19 test system for visitors, if necessary, with self disinfection after every use. Security camera and alarm can be set off if there is inappropriate use or if someone is trying to bypass the system. This is suitable for areas such as big and high risk events or locations where mandatory testing is required for every visitor. Having robots can avoid human error and minimize infections too through interaction. Function four, improve TV panels on the robot with videos on health and safety information to inform, promote, and educate visitors on necessary information regarding COVID-19 or any health and safety matters. This TV panel can attract attention, especially when we expect huge queues for entry area to minimize talking. Function five, improve function of dispensers on the robot for necessary items, depending on situation, such as masks, disinfection kits, or self-testing kits. Thank you for listening to my presentation.